Hello everyone, welcome to our channel. I am CryptoDate and today we will be taking you through a quick tutorial on how to stop staking and unbond funds from your Kusama account. In our previous video, we talked about how can you start staking and nominating from your Kusama account. If you haven't seen that video yet, then we really encourage you to check that video. There is a link in the description below. On Kusama network, nominators are participants in the staking system that are responsible for electing good validators for a share in those validators rewards and help secure the chain. However, if for any reason you want to stop staking and withdraw your funds, you can do that anytime. So let's get straight to know how can you stop staking and unbond funds from your Kusama account. In order to stop staking from your Kusama account, you need to go to the account actions page in the staking section. Click on the stop button located on the right hand side of the account you are staking from. Enter your password and then click on sign and submit. Once your transaction is broadcasted, you will see that you no longer will have any nomination active and the staking has stopped. An important thing to remember here is to unbond your funds right after you stop staking. To do that, simply select unbond funds as shown here on the screen. Enter the unbonding amount. You can unbond the entire amount if you have two separate accounts set up, one as stash and one as controller for staking. Otherwise, make sure to leave some funds aside for the transaction fees. Check the details and click on Unbond at the bottom right corner of the page. And then click on Sign and Submit on the next one. If you get an error, as you can see on the screen, this means that your controller account has insufficient balance to pay for transaction fees. Simply deposit some funds to pay for transaction fees in your controller account and go back to the account actions page in the staking section. Select unbond funds as shown here on the screen. Enter the unbonding amount as I mentioned earlier. You can unbond the entire amount if you have two separate accounts set up, one as stash and one as controller for staking. Check the details and click on unbond at the bottom right corner of the page and then click on sign and submit on the next one. Once the transaction has been broadcasted, you can see a little clock icon will appear right next to your Kusama amount, which will tell you in how much time your funds will be free for you to transfer. You have now successfully stopped staking and unbonded your funds from your Kusama account. So guys, this was a tutorial on how to stop staking and unborn funds from your Kusama account. You will find all the links in the description below. We hope this was helpful and you guys liked it. Subscribe to our channel as in our coming videos, we will be bringing you more updates and tutorials related to Kusama network. Till then, stay active and logical we will see you in the next one.